Hello everyone, this is Jamita Varma. Welcome back to Bumitechi. So in this video, we will learn about most important topics for interview. So let's see the first topic about uh, atom worker. What is atom worker? So an atom worker is a reserve resource in Bumi atom cloud or in private atom cloud that is decided to process certain type of request for given account. Atom worker are available only for atom clouds ms not for single tenant molecule or atom right so use an atom worker to improve performance for example when process call volume is high or low latency required note atom cloud and the atom worker that run on the huge fog execution which mean that each process execute in separate JVM, they are not compatible with the multi-thread. The following connector can use Atom Worker. AS2 Shared Server, Atom Q, Flow Services Server, JMS, MDM Listener, Microsoft Azure Service Bus, MLL Server, Salesforce Platform Event, SAP, Web Services Server. Next point low latency journal and glitch mode so let's see about low latency so the low latency option for process greatly increase the speed at which process executes by on logging every state of the process general mode in general mode we can see the details log and documents bridge mode in bridge mode, we can see the logs but not document. Most important question, how to eliminate duplicate record in document cache? Option 1, you should be able to do this using enforce unique option in flat file or database profile. This approach won't work in other profile like JSON and EDI. It's for only data base profile flat file profile so here we can see we need to enforce unique id right and second option second option you need to split data based on the user id and then use flow control shape for run each document individually then decision shape check whether cache user id is equal to blank or not then we can move those document based on the true and false path next how to access repetitive data and how to prevent appearing repetitive data segments in the profile level so profile level configuration you will choose max occur unbounded looping op option occurrence and max occur unbounded what that mean so if the same document has multiple xml document under the single root like below then all the looped in process by the map looping option occurrence if the same xml document item is repeated the second time in the same xml document which has all the xml doc documents under the same root then they will also consider process by map for example you can see xml data this is a one file and looping many time item one exit item item two exit item three exit profile level configuration max occurrence unbounded looping option unique max occurrence unbounded if the same document has multiple documents in single roots like below then all are looped in process what is del Bumi and what are its key features so del Bumi is a cloud based integration platform that enable organization to connect applications and data across cloud and on prime environment its key features include visual integration, pre-built connectors, data mapping, API management and real-time monitoring. How do you create a process in Boomi? To create process in Boomi, you would log into Boomi platform 
navigate to the process tab and click on create process from there you can use process builder interface to define the steps of integration process such as mapping decision step error handling what are connectors in delbomi connector in delbomi are pre-built integration components that facilitate seamless communication between various application database and services they simplify the integration process by abstracting the underlying complexity of different system explain the difference between synchronous and asynchronous process in bomi so in bomi synchronous and asynchronous are real time integrations that execute immediately and return result immediately asynchronous process on the other hand are non real time integrations that get queued for execution and may take some time to complete how do you handle error handling and exception in bomi bomi provides various error handling option like try catch shape and exception shape when an error occur during the integration process these shapes allow you to specify how to handle the exception log the error and send notification what is difference between process property and profile property in delbomi so process property are specific to single process and can be used to pass data within that process profile property on other hand are global and can shared across multiple process making them useful maintaining and configuration consistency how can you deploy a bomi process to production to deploy a bomi process to production you would create a deployment package containing a process and related component then using atmosphere platform you can deploy the package to desired environment such as test and production what is a connector operation and in bomi how do you configure it a connector operation represents an action that can be performed on a specific connector such as verify data such as querying data from database or invoking a rest api to con configure it you select the connector specify the operation details and map the input and output data what does delbomi ensure data security and compliance bomi ensure data security through encryption at the rest and in transit role based access control and compliance with the industry standards such as gdpr and hipa hipa additionally it provide audit trail and monitoring to track data access and changes how would you design a scalable and efficient integration process in bomi to design a scalable and efficient integration process you would follow best practices such as minimizing the use of complex data transformation utilizing bulk operation when possible optimizing query filter and considering the load on both source and target systems testing and performance tuning are also essential to ensure scalability explain the different type of deployment option available in bomi bomi offers three deployment options atom cloud molecule and atom atom cloud is a multi tenant platform hosted by bomi suitable for most integration molecule is a on prem deployment that provides additional performance and scalability for high volume scenario atom is a lightweight on prem deployment option for simple integration how do you handle large data volume efficiently in delbomi to handle large data volume efficiently you can use bomi batch processing feature it allow you to split large data set into smaller chunk process them in batches and then merge the result additionally utilizing bulk operation when supported by the connectors can improve performance document cache in bomi 
document cache is a features in boomi that allow you to store frequently accessed data temporarily by caching data in memory subsequent queries for some data become faster reducing the need to reprocess or retrieve data from source system thus improve overall integration performance can you explain concept of process call in boomi and its benefit a process call in boomi allow you to invoke one integration process from another it promotes a reusability and modularization of integration logic by using process calls you can avoid duplicate common step and create more maintainable and organized integration process how does boomi handle error recovery in case of process failure boomi provides a build in mechanism for error recovery through the use of process monitoring and requeuing if a process failed it can be automatically requeued be retried later or you can manually requeue specific document for reprocessing what is different between deployed and test mode when a process is deployed in test mode it runs with the limited resource and is instead for testing purpose on other hand when process is deployed on deployed in deployed mode it run with the production level resource and handle real world integration scenario how can you improve custom logging and error handling in boomi processes boomi allow you to implement custom logging and error handling by using custom scripting such as groovy script or custom logging connector you can capture a specific data point perform custom validations and send custom notification based on the your integration requirement what are advantage of using boomi over traditional point to point integration boomi offers several advantages over traditional point to point integration including faster development and deployment increased reusability through connector and components centralized monitoring and manage and enhanced scalability to handle complex integration scenario can you explain how boomi supports api management and creation boomi provides api management capability that allow you to create publish secure and manage apis you can use the api management feature to control access to api set rate limit and monitor api use and performance how do you ensure data integrity during data transformation in boomi to ensure data integrity during data transformation you can implement validation step using various function provided by boomi such as data type check regular expression and condition statement additionally you can leverage boomi build in data mapping feature to ensure accurate data transformations what is connector extension in boomi and how can be beneficial a connector extension in custom built connector that extends and capabilities of boomi by integrating with the specific application or service not available through standard connectors it allow you to connect to specialized system and applications enhancing the performance the platform versatility how does boomi handle data transformation between different format boomi provides build in data mapping component that facilitate data transformation between various format like json xml and flat file the platform allow you to define mapping rule data type conversation and hierarchical structure to ensure seamless transformation and hierarchical explain the concept of dynamic process property in boomi and when to use them dynamic process property in boomi are used to pass dynamic value at run time making process more flexible and reusable these property can be set at the time of the process customization at the process behavior execution
enabling you to cost based on the specific input parameter what are different type of connector provided by Bumi. So Bumi offers various type of connector including application connector, Salesforce NetSuite, database connector, SQL Server Oracle and message connector JVM, Rabbit and Q and protocol connector HTTP, FTP. What is the role of the Atom in Bumi architecture? So the Atom is a runtime engine in Bumi responsible for executing integration process it can be installed on prime and in the cloud process data and execute integration securely and efficiently how does boomi support real time integration scenario so boomi support real time integration scenario through its real time execution mode by enabling this mode the platform process documents as soon as they arrive reducing latency and provide real time data synchronous to explain the concept of map function in bomi data process set the map function in data process set bomi allow you to perform advanced data manipulating manipulation using groovy script it offer more flexible and handle complex data transformation and validations how can you implement custom exception handling in Boomi process? Custom exception handling can be implemented using custom scripting with the try cache shape by writing Groovy script take appropriate actions. What is the purpose of connection retry setting in Boomi connector? Connection retry setting allow you to specific number of retry attempt the connector make to establish connection with the target system in case transist network issues or connectivity problem adjusting these settings may be necessary in scenario where the target system is temporarily unavailable how can you monitor and track the execution of boomi process boomi provides a comprehensive monitoring dashboard that allow you to track execution of the process view executions statics and monitor any error or exceptions that occur during the integration how does boomi handle data transformation and integrity security dell boomi ensure data transformation integration security through encryption of data rest and transist role based on the control secure connection setting and things and compliance with the industry standard and regulation what is the purpose of environment extension in Boomi? Environment extension in Boomi are used to define environment specific setting that can be applied during the deployment process. These ensure that process rename consistent across different environment while supporting environment specific configuration. What are the best practices for error handling and monitor in Boomi? Some best practices of error handling and monitoring, monitoring include using try cache for handling exception, logging error to central logging system, setting up email notification for critical error and implementing process monitoring and alerting. How does Boomi support EDI electronic data interchange? integration boomi provide a specific connector and component for edi integration allow seamless communication with the trading partner using standard edi format like x12 and edi fact the platform support both inbound and outbound edi transactions boomi interview questions and tips understand dell boomi core concept review integration patterns hands-on experience data transformation and mapping and API connector knowledge tips troubleshoot skill capability mock interview and practice research Dell Boomi culture and ask thoughtful questions